Hi guys, in this video we learn about how to remove duplicates from single files or how to remove duplicates from related multiple files, how to use unique row component and how to use unit component, t unit component and how to load data from csv to database. For that we need a csv file. This is the csv file. In this we have records like duplicate records. These are the actual unique records but these are completely a duplicate records from this file we have to we want to get only unique records like this like this for that we need to create a talent job open talent studio in this create a job give a name to the job like duplicate remove duplicates remove duplicates click on finish job is created in this we have to load that first csv file for that we need to create a file delimited give a name employee duplicate dup next and select the file employee csv select the file this will show the preview of that file click on next then select the delimiter that is the comma and first row is a header employee ID, employee name these are the headers so set the head, heading row as a column then click on refresh it will show the data we can expand and view these are the actual data then click on next automatically it will take the column names and data types click on finish the file is loaded into talent then drag and drop this file into workspace like t file input delimited because it is the input file then we have to use t unique component t unique row or we can type here or we can select from here t unique row drag and drop to the workspace then connect from input source to unique row component then open the t unique row component properties in this we have to select the key attribute actually there are every every column data is duplicated like for example 101 john 15010 here again 101 john 15000 all columns are same all columns data is same so we can give all columns we can select all columns for key attributes or we can select any because all the records are duplicated then by using tlog row component we can view the data on the panel unix to tlog row and select the table to view the data clearly then run the data these are the unique records we got it we got the unique records If you want to load this data into a table, we have to connect to the database. Like I have connected already to Oracle database. Drag and drop that Oracle to workspace, and we need to select as DB output because we want to store the data into Oracle. That is the output. Select that output. Connect to that Unix to Oracle output. In this, we have to then. Give, we have to give already we specify all the properties when we are connecting to the database here we have to sorry it is changed okay we have to give the table name like employee tunix employee unique okay if the table is not there we then we have to create the table here we can select create table it does, does not exist then again run the job yeah job run successfully from 17 records 7 to 7 records that is distinct records unique records are loaded into database we can check it by opening oracle from here first we have to refresh the tables refresh then select star from we can select the table name from here
copy and paste here control enter to run the data these are the unique records same related files like for example this is the previous file and this is the new file new csv file in this we have new records these four are new records and these four are these four are pair these are already existing duplicate records from these two uh, files we have to get only unique records for that in the same talent job we have to connect to another csv file emp2 we can give any name to identify browse for that file employee 2 click on next and the same comma delimiter and first row is header then click on refresh these are the records click on next the data type and column names click on finish then drag and drop emp2 to the workspace file same file input then we have to connect to t unique remove this connection we we need t unit component to merge two same type of files connect to t unit then employee to connect to t unit first of all to use t unit component the same column name should be column names not column names column data type and column count should be same from the source files which we are connecting then connect t unit to t unique row the schema is same but we can change we can click on s2 modify the changes showing error like the schema of the input links of the merge component unit of different check the schema view schema we have four second view the schema we have four columns first we remove select tila grow to view the data we check what is the error tila grow select table and run the job yeah it ran successfully we got 10 records 10 unique records we can also view the duplicate records which are not satisfied the condition we can give the name as unique rows and take another tlagro component the name is duplicate rows connect from t unique t unique row component to duplicates to duplicates and select the table to view data in a table format clear and run job again now these are the unique records, unique rows, duplicate rows. From second TLAG row, we got duplicate records. Like this, we can load, we can remove duplicates from multiple sources. Thank you.